Hi YouTube, welcome to Harvest Helper. We are the Processing Solution Center located in Olympia, Washington. Our website is harvesthelpertrimstore.com. Today we're going to give you an overview of all of our equipment. We've been renting and selling automatic trim equipment for a while and we're going to get you familiar with each piece of our machinery. Being a processing solution center, the number one question that comes through my door every day is, Bailey, wet trimming or dry trimming? What should I be doing? Um, I am right next door to Integrity Labs, so scientifically we know the answer to that. If you can, at all possible, um, dry trim. Our, the marijuana was meant to be hung and the gases are released through a process of drying. That doesn't happen. It interrupts the process when you do wet trimming. However, not every farm is um, designed with a system that enables them to do so. So, um, so we have trimmers for both and we have trimmers that I can recommend for both and you can still end up with a quality product in the end. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and introduce you to our machines. Um, down here I have the Centurion Pro Original. Um, this is a tumble style trimmer. This trimmer was designed for wet trimming and producing large quantities very, very quickly. This Centurion comes with a hopper to hold the untrimmed cannabis, a blower, and a trim collect bag. So there's a lot more to it than just what you see right here. Um, after people started talking about wet trimming versus dry trimming, what's better, what turns out best, yada, 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 um, both the Twister Company, which we sell Twisters as well, we just don't rent them, we do sell them, um, and the Centurion Company both came up with a dry attachment tumbler for their machines. So it has um, smaller, um, smaller sections in between the grade and it allows for a nice, quick, efficient dry trim. And again, this, this machine here does eight to 12 pounds per hour. This one here is the Satellite Slim by Easy Trim. This, this machine was also designed to be a wet trimmer and they also added an attachment. It's just a, a flat grid and that attachment was free of charge. Um, it slides right into the middle of it and bam, you're dry trimming. Um, this machine is going to produce about four to seven pounds an hour, depending on um, depending on the, the beginning product, if you're trimming wet, if you're trimming dry. Um, it has a vortex action, so there's a fan underneath that's going to suck the bud down to the blade. And then your trim is going to be filtered into a three-stage filtration process. And when you're through, your bud's when you're ready for them to be um, to be done, they're going to come into here and then out the bottom there. And then your trim will be in these bags separated nicely. Okay, moving on to the Green Bros commercial trimmer. This trimmer was designed for dry trimming. This trimmer does a fantastic job at dry trimming. It's my buddy for sure. It's going to trim eight to 12 pounds an hour for you. The, the trim's gonna come out the bottom here into a, a food grade bin. It's um, really, really movable and really easy to clean. We also have the tabletop version. This one weighs 35 pounds. This machine is really, really easy for anybody to use, anybody to move. It, it goes in any kind of environment. It's really versatile um, for any kind of growing situation. So as long as you're dry trimming, this is definitely a great option. This one here is gonna do two to four pounds per hour. So again, these machines were really, really, really intended to lower, lower your labor costs because that's really what's um, killing a lot of the farmers out there right now is the cost of labor. Um, when you're dry trimming, it is, it's critical that your cannabis is dry. Um, we also have the Terminator dry machine over here. This one was also designed for dry trimming only. So with all of these machines, when you decide to use it for dry trimming, you're gonna wanna pick one of these up. It's a general moisture meter. Wearing a glove so you don't interrupt the, um, the reed. 
you're just going to insert one of these points into the center of your butt and it's going to read right there and you're going to want to be between um, between three and nine if you pass 10 percent moisture you're just tearing it up and you're and, and you're not getting a quality trim and that goes for every single one of these machines i haven't seen a dry trimmer successfully trim um, with a higher moisture than 10 percent Again, my name's Bailey with Harvest Helper. If you have any questions, you can call me directly at 509-212-0360.